the population growth of the Rio Grande Valley has created other issues for many of its cities. That is infrastructure falling behind as the number of residents goes up. So that's one of the reasons why McGallan is considering asking voters to approve a multi-million dollar bond issue. There's a total of $46 million worth of work to do in drainage. We're only asking for 22 because we've identified other funding sources for the rest of the projects. While the bonds are separated on the ballot, according to the city, residents will be paying about $24 a year if the bonds are issued. To identify concerns within the community, the city of McAllen sends residents surveys every three years. It's a random survey to our citizens that asks them to score us on our city services. And uh, what we did this last year, three things that scored highly were uh, facilities, buildings and so on, uh, drainage and traffic mobility. And residents can see that drainage infrastructure needs work at around $22 million. As far as the drainage, uh, I think there's some areas in, in McAllen that do need some improvement. 10th Street needs a little bit of improvement. Uh, other areas do great, some areas don't do as good. Along with traffic control at around $3 million. Uh, it's, it's strictly all of the signalization and the timing uh, between those signals. Uh, controllers, cabinets, basically the brains behind all of the traffic signals. I think the amount on the traffic bond is, seems reasonable. The drainage amount, uh, gosh, it seemed a little bit, it's a little bit maybe uh, something that the citizens should certainly look at. The city wants to make sure that residents understand that in order to make improvements around town, residents have to be willing to pay for it. In McAllen, with Complete Valley coverage, Jolani Martinez, CBS4 Valley at 6.